All right, well, here we go. Easter weekend, Saturday morning, out on the bikes. This is the first time I've ridden the 890 this year. Uh, if you follow the channel, you know I bought it back in uh, the autumn last year. We had a great weekend up in the Brecon Beacons. Did 600 miles, got home, did the first service. And that was the last time I rode it, which would have been back in October. And I've just all I've done is gone out and looked at it in the garage every other night. <laughs> uh, but I've been out for a few rides this year, though, on the GT. I uh, haven't hit the camera on all of them, uh, but it's, the weather's superb. We were meant to be going out on Monday, but the weather looks uh, not as good. Uh, in fact, it looks, looks quite bad actually. So we're meeting up with John, and we're heading up to the Lake District. Uh, you'll know John from the videos, he's got the Super Adventure. I've got obviously on the 890, which I absolutely love, and I can't wait for today. Uh, and I think we're going to catch up with a couple of the lads. Steve, who's got his uh, a new Super Adventure S as well and his mate Adam, they're doing the six passes in the Lake District so uh, we're going to maybe, maybe hook up with them, see it, play that one by ear if we get up there we can join up, we will, if not we'll carry on I've got the, the new Insta 360, going to try that out today let's see what the footage is like on the video uh, catch you later ok, yep Nice view on the left, John. Don't, don't miss it. Oh, fucking hell, yeah. Wow. That's the, what, what a house that is there. Yeah, oh. lovely spot, isn't it? That is I think that mountain on the left is the old man at Coniston. like a pass in its own right, this road. Oh, beautiful. The landscape amazing. The landscape's amazing, isn't it? Wow. I've, yeah, I've never done this road. No. Thank you. Twenty-five percent. Lots of suspension's a bit firm on this. Yeah. 
Yeah, the suspension's a bit firm for this road. I know. What a view. Oh, Ace. I know. The Rhino Pass. Rhino's Pass. Just look at the view down there, though. It is just outstanding, the view. Yeah, and it's all in such a short place. And the, thing to, the job to do now is get the cars walking top of it. Yeah. I'll have to go and see it. So, th these mountains must be the, the Langdales, are they? I don't know. Yeah, we're, we're, we're going into the Langdale Valley, okay. I think, when we go down the other side. Outstanding. Outstanding. You ready? Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, definitely need uh, an adventure type bike for this type of stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, this is meant for the uh, the smooth stuff. Yeah, he's giving up. I must admit, I would. Oh, they're all. <laughs> Oh, so this must be the 25% one, wasn't it? Wow. That's a hell of a view, isn't it? It's a bit steep, I think, isn't it? Yeah. I've got it all on video for you. Yeah, definitely need uh, an adventure type bike for this type of stuff. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, this is meant for the uh, the smooth stuff. Don't want to put up in. Oh, so this must be the 25% one, wasn't it? Wow. That's a hell of a view, isn't it? Your suspension is nice and smooth, isn't it? Well, I, I, as you probably know, you don't. Know. <laughs> <laughs> you haven't got automatic, have you? Any chance, John? No, mate, I've got the fully automatic. The fully automatic. <laughs> the old bit of wild camping there. I always get hard knot and hard side mixed up. Hard side is the one up the other side of Penrith, isn't it? Yeah, up to the biker cafe on the top. Yeah, that's this is hard. This is. Yeah. And this is hard not. It is, yeah, yeah. Oh dear, yeah. It's the bumps on that have caused me the problem, not the incline or the twisties.
Whoop. I did, yeah. Sorry. Yeah, I stalled it, yeah. It's twisty, isn't it? Oh, this isn't the bike for this at all. <laughs> I've forgotten how to ride. I'm riding it slipping the bloody clutch all the way. <laughs> Is that automatic hill start? Yeah, this must be the top. Yeah, what's the view like on the ground here? But, yeah, look at that view. Look at that view there. It does. You enjoying the bike? I didn't realise it was you two until you literally just came here then. I'm thinking, what are these guys waiting for? Then I saw them, you stalled, did you? And I thought, oh, that must be Adam. <laughs> and then I realised you got the same helmet, I thought, ah! Yeah, yeah. I've had a long bike for, for the week, for the, uh, for the F900. Yeah. Crap, was it? It was a little V twin, but I just can't. Oh my god. Yeah. Because I've had a boy that a couple of times. What do you reckon? That's about 10 minutes and then I'm like, I don't know why. Didn't like it? It's big, innit? Yeah, This feels like a like a bicycle. It's, it's only 160 kilos. It's dead light, really light. Goes like a rocket, though, Chase. Look at that, a, a Prius Sport. Good lad. Okay. After you, John. Oh dear. You okay, mate? Yeah. Oh, didn't seem too happy. <laughs> yeah, he's all right. Yeah. Wow, that's a view and a half again. Oh my God. Oh, go on, mate. What's he doing? Oh, he's not stopping, is he? Oh dear, this is steep. This is practice for Austria and Switzerland, John. I 
like he was shitting himself. It's a good job I've got this really soft suspension on this bike. <laughs> <laughs> Just got to keep a bit of momentum going, if anything. Civilised. Yeah, there's another place as well, so I'm just trying to work out where we are. I've been here before with my girlfriend. Nice sneaky little pint of shandy and a packet of crisps. Yeah. Go on. Off, off to where are we at? The Barrow Coast Road and then swing home for a barbecue yeah. or something tonight. Big sheep, huh? Look like it wasn't going to move for you then. I know, I thought they could give it me more than I thought give it more. Good road. Yeah, it's good. Decent bit of tarmac. <laughs> yeah. Picture here, do you think? Yeah, yeah. I think we need, I think we need to do a picture there, don't we? Look at that. Oh, that's a cracking, cracking view, that. Get your wheel straight on your bike. Fucking rocket launchers out at the back. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking better push it in, it looks stupid. Like anything, you know, look where you want to go rather than where you are, it always helps, doesn't it? Yeah, go on and then the bumps put you off your dinner. <laughs> ah, main road. Which way now? Right. It, it is spectacular around here, it's just another random river. Uh, beautiful. In the storm, it's just fabulous. I like to go and do it on, like, I don't think it's deep enough to go and get a, you know, a little canoe and go down there. We're in Austria, you know, we should, play, we should be just find a, situ a situation where we get a bit of lunch somewhere, you know, put, get a bit of a packed lunch and just stop at the odd yeah, random that, river that, and, that, uh, that uh, and, you know, boots off, feet in the water. Oh, it's a different type of ride today, a bit, of, a bit slow and twisty and bumpy and whatever, it's been good. It's a bit technical, mate. Yeah. Technical. We're 
getting back onto the normal roads in a minute. So yeah. Bike comes alive. Got this is where this bike comes alive. Oh yeah. Mom on a sheet. Oh, this is where you went straight on, John. <laughs> you remember? Yeah, fucking hell, you're looking for <laughs> <the road. Yeah. laughs> Didn't somebody else go straight on on the way back? Aye. It's a 4.35, I think. It is. 